go back. Yep, we're ba back here again, and we're on the and we're on the final character. Character. This is Val. Val. Got a needle. Now, uh, so. Oh, get that back on. There you go. And so. So, um. So we'll. So this playthrough, we'll use his, uh. His. Use Val's canonical relic. Uh, which is the Horn of Satan. Yeah! Right, and so. So this. So if it. So basically, arch demons will do more damage, but their, but their, but their total life is gutted by a quarter. <laughs> All right, so, so Val's kid, kid, it, it is, is he's the second melee character, character, and he is designed much more to be a speedster. Speedster, speedster. So his attacks compared to Ara come out way faster. Yeah, I've noticed all the characters seem particularly fast, so I was like, "I bet yep. you this is the one." <laughs> yep, and in, and is it aerial? And if he does, and if he fires it off in the air and the enemy's far enough, there's not if he'll he will he will he will just he will just homing dash right into them. Got snap attack. <laughs> yep. In addition to that, his aerial attacks give him some hover. If he gets the lock on off with these, off with that. That too, he will he will hover in the he will hover in the air, air with his air attacks. Max, Max, he is also on the further side, just like just like Sidna, uh, Sidna, but he but he is a very fast and aggressive character. I do appreciate these characters the most, actually. Those are the ones I usually like to play. <laughs> like yeah, like like with the yeah like. Yeah, and you don't like Val, cause like half the time you don't even need the health break breaker with some, with some. <laughs> Third enemies give you have um, more payout. Uh, usually characters that remove the need for a certain mechanic usually are easier to play too. Not the case with Val. Not the case with Val, because like I said, he's on the further further side. He doesn't have that R rock bulk. <laughs> so you do have to be careful with him. Uh, yeah. At least until you get defensive perks. Perks, and like I said, he's he is very eva evasive and can hit and run just perfectly fine, or just hit and hit, depending on where you're at in the game. All right, we got the annihilator clause. So Val's Val's works differently depending on if you get the you get the lock on dash or not. So so with the lock on dash, annihilator will shoot out three dart and three dart and darts that will bounce around all over the area. Area. All right. If you don't get the lock on off, you'll just have a chance of firing off one dart. I see. Make some darts go crazy. Yep. So annihilator heavily favors lot playing around hit and lock, lock on, lock on, lock on. But it can, but it, but it can do some serious serious damage and rule clearing duties. Oh, All right, and we... and this is the one in. I know we didn't do this one in there in area one, which is the trial of the necropire. Yeah, this sounds weird. What's so trialy about so, it? So basically, oh, there's an. Yep, it's an auto scroller, and to top it all off, there is a r rolling fire at the bottom of the sta stage. If you take damage from that fire, fire, you die instantly. I see, and that seems like an annoying wall. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you can say, tell why I didn't want to do do this area when I was do this one specifically when I was rusty. Nope. Well, yep, nice. Now you, now you, yeah. Yeah, like I said, if you take damage from the fire, you die instantly. But it does. But you can iframe it. That's hilarious. <laughs> oh yeah, it's it's the funniest bit of this room. Uh, at least that keeps you from getting knocked into it by an enemy, sort of. <laughs> yep. Yep. Server's claw. Uh, so server's claws effect is that 
is that you'll have a chance to do a single chain lightning if you do the if you do a regular attacks max and the light uh, and the light and lock on strike will will do have the exact same properties as hellbreaker gotcha hey Ooh, uh, extra damage for the talent that's really good <laughs> Since you usually get every talent, at least one talent each time you get one. Yeah, true, but that caps out at 20, and this is just 20 off the bat, and it's dirt oh, cheaper. Yeah. <laughs> wow, that's weird. <laughs> I guess stacking like the, them is good, but it's like. <laughs> yeah, like stacking them is good, good. Yeah, like stacking them, that's when it gets good. That's when it gets good, but yeah, there's really no reason to buy that one if you get offered both of them. It's weird that a lesser uh, one would be just functionally better than a gold one. <laughs> just not even like that's like a hard upgrade too. <laughs> oh well. Yep, annihilator class showing off, off why it's so good until you do, until you just lock on into the wrong thing. I was about to call that thing a dog, but all dogs are good, boys, and you're in hell, so that thing is definitely a bull. <laughs> I mean, that's my dog. Yog the bull, not the dog. <laughs> he is one of these things of all time. <laughs> yep, he is a thing. <laughs> hey, first expert. Uh, temp buff, nah. Trap immunity might not be terrible, this character. Fellblade will be useful, maybe? Uh, that, uh, free soul cipher says, I do have, yeah, that actually wouldn't, wouldn't be too bad. I've got, I got two soul going. All right, you want to see, the, you ready to see this first boss just fold? Oh, is he, is Val really good at him? Yeah. Remember how I said that he can just hover in the air with air attacks? Yeah, I've noticed this guy doesn't have uh, very much uh, attacks right on the eye. <laughs> yeah, you can kind of just do this the whole <laughs> fight. <laughs> fight, and if he tries to, and if he tries using like any of the things, just wait for a second, and then you just go back to it. That's hilarious. And then he never uses attack. the monster spawn thing because you're way too close to him. He'll just try to use the bullets. Bullets can't even hit you when you're doing that. Yeah, it's just yeah, Hell gets just absolute free real estate on the first boss. Well, that was hitless, so that was pretty good. <laughs> nice and easy. <laughs> just, it's just oh man, it's just uh, it just makes the like that's the biggest quirk with using Val in any of these runs is that you just make the first boss trivial. <laughs> Sold. All right, and now area two. All right, and looks like there's a few more hands I can pick up before I do that. Now Val, you have, yeah, you gotta be a little bit careful with, with Val's lock on when, when, to, when trying to get as much as you can before going up, up uh, because like sometimes the target can hit something above you and then you get locked, locked out on accident. <laughs> All right, Cerberus. Now Cerberus is a pretty fun perk for him, for him. So when he locks on, he creates a shadow clone. Well, you just picked up another one, so. Yeah, I know. It's a shame we can't. Yeah, see I know. It. Well, I got it off there in the. Well, I got there off there or off of, for one lock lock on maneuver. Maneuver. It was definitely a blink you would miss moment. Well, you know, people could just go back and look at it in slow motion, <laughs> which is a function on YouTube that some people forget exists. <laughs> Alrighty, here we go. 
Take damage to that. Increases. Oh, boss killer. Yeah, boss slayer. <laughs> Here we go. Uh, all right, so we did both of them, so I'm just going to stick to this one. Did we do the pestilence card? I don't remember. Uh, yeah, we did. Um, yeah, we did. That's the one. That's the uh, room, room where, it, where you have the toxin can can from another from another venom, but in a, bo a boss arena. No, I meant this one. Oh. Oh, trickster strategy, perfect. Sir, so that artifact monster stress souls. I mean, you've got a lot of soul gaining. <laughs> Uh, atrocious, dark reed for more, more things, yeah. and yeah, might as well just take the extra heal. And because you have a perk that increases your power base on red orbs, you might as well take that. <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay. Hopefully, I can get some health perks here. Gonna clean these up for the extra orbs. There we go. Uh, Half-life, the ammo reduction. More red souls. See. See that. You do get powered up from, from more red orbs, and that costs less. <laughs> yeah, that's true. It, it, also increases, it, it also increases the spawn rate for them. Oh, God. Oh, no, no, no. It's not the boss yet. Okay. Yeah, you haven't even gotten the mid boss yet. Look, I'm sorry, okay? If there's a five, if I have some PTSD experience. <laughs> Guy, yeah, he's a uh, tanky. Uh, his arcs are on uh, his attacks are also hard to dodge when you're right next to him. I mean, it'd help if I stood on the ground. Well, you've only got one left, so watch out. <laughs> there we go. Ooh, that was close. <laughs> Got that one a little close. There. For each talent. You got a lot of talents. Uh, I just I need more health. Alright. Oh, so I'm get so I'm getting the health suite going. Hey, you got six six six. Okay, we've definitely done the night of this a lot. <laughs> Alright, well, do it again. <laughs> well, that was easy. All that extra DPS is really pulling through. <laughs> Yep. Oh. Yeah, that guy went off, so I'm just gonna pop this. Motherfucker. Oh, this Fonz is so shit. Oh, 
Oh, for fuck's sake. Well. <laughs> it's a good thing we had that mode on. Can you imagine if you died there of all things? Yeah. <laughs> oh. oh, you had so many orbs, too. <laughs> Well, come back anyway. I guess if the place is exactly the same as it was before. You see, that corner is safe, Cody. You remember that. <laughs> He just forced us to the vault of hell. Well, yeah, I think that's the point. <laughs> Pretty sure they're all vaults of hell, technically. There we go. Definitely want the attack power. I'll take tri I'll take the Trickster's Treasury mod. Alright. Man, I have seen the Shadow Clone go off, so. Oh, they do a lot of damage too. Yeah, it has. Yeah, the Shadow Clone will have the exact same mods that you do. You don't accidentally grab the other artifact. <laughs> yeah, however, it'll only t attack the same target. However, it only attacks the same tar target if there's no other targets available. Well, helping you clear out the scrubs is useful too, in its own way. <laughs> The center orb doesn't have much health. There, there we go. go. Much better than the last one. <laughs> yeah, they didn't Going give you the purple thing. <laughs> yeah, it was too far. <laughs> that sucks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, welcome to Basil Bob. It just sucks. Uh, since I got tricks just broke, I'm just gonna take the heal. Alright. Alright, time for this this noise to be near for 90% of the map. Oh yeah. Uh, there's a treasury, so I'm just gonna clear out this area first. All righty. Let's go see our friend here. <laughs> Better grab that while it's not while it's on. Take damage for explosion. That. Uh. Remember, every twenty-five souls you have more damage. So. That's here. Buying an expensive thing you don't need might not be healthy. <laughs> yeah, I'll take the kill streak for. Alright. And. Do not need that. And yeah, that's a temp boost. Not worth it. Okay. 
Oh yeah. Juicy noise. Go. Just make sure I got everything. Okay. Next line. Pulse boost. Nice. Yeah, I got the explosion. I don't think I need point and perk. Uh, and yeah, I'll just take the health boost. Alrighty. So, pretty sure we haven't done pillars. Yeah, I don't think we did either of those. Uh, I know we did Dread Fortress because we had a bit about it. You're right, we did. Yeah, so this area's make there's energy blades on the wall walls and and there'll be lasers coming down. Such an annoying setup. <laughs> yeah. the lasers wouldn't be too bad, but that realized how many narrow vertical hallways you have to go up in this game. <laughs> yeah. Alright, damage block. Here we go. Invincibility, go! <laughs> Uh, it's not invincibility, I just blocked the damage. The damage? It'll, break my, it'll still break my combo. Okay, there we go. Uh... And... Really useful. Um, we'll just take this one. Gives a bit more of a lifeline. And that uh, gets the defense sweep going. Oh, yeah, and this, this is the flapper one. One, it just shoots more feathers. Feathers. I get to stink it. There we go. Alrighty. Let's see what these perks give us. Damage taken. Mm. More lighting. I might as well just take this one. Because I have a low because I have a low artifact, so that'll just be an extra bo boost here. And the Tower of the Fallen. Actually snap upwards. <laughs> yeah. All right. All, all of Everest. Yeah. 
go. Oh, I missed the behemoth's heart. Oh, well. Yeah, that might have been useful. Quick heals. Okay, there we go. Uh, I frame slide one, 20 attack, Don't max life. Attack. Honestly, I'm going to say max life because that completes the health suite and that's going to be a massive HP swing. Gotcha. Yeah, now I'm at 165 health. Naked, dude. Yep. Come on. Ow. No. <laughs> Have I ruined him for you? <laughs> <laughs> Every time you can see him, he's gonna be like, "Oh, that's Rick." It's so better. It's so better. <laughs> boost. <laughs> Grab that. Okay, what do we got here? Uh, crit damage? Ooh, that'll be useful. Yeah, might as well grab... Yeah, I'll just grab these two perks. Okay, that finished off that set. Jason Tom. Yeah, those shadow clones seem like they're very useful. Yeah, they are. They're just something you don't want to build so to grab the Cerberus perk over, though. Oh wow, it just died in one cycle. That was easy. <laughs> well, easy enough. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, uh. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, we've already seen this. Might as well skip ahead to the actual character ending. Let's see, that's something interesting today. <laughs> Alright. Uh, so. Oh, Cody. See? 
<laughs> hey, Steve for Cody. It works. It works. <laughs> All right, here we go. Behold, the son of the true king of hell. I was literally born just a while ago. Go, if I had no problem foot kicking the false king. Well, you're playing as a toddler? That's hilarious. Yep. <laughs> this incredible and terrifying power. It's my father's blood after all. Now that Valaya was gone, these three hell hell's being barriers shall help me break the seal and resurrect King Satan. Hail Satan. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Wait for me, Father. Hell shall have its one and true king back. <laughs> They're just kind of rolling with yep. it. Eh, uh, so basically... So basic <laughs> So basically, it kind of reveals kind of like what the whole thing was going going on, which what which was that Mephis was that Mephisto who was the one that create who was the one that helped, helped with Val's create creation creation was basically get, get was basically getting the other three 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 to three set uh, set up uh, set up with the Archdemon stat status to be able to help. To be able to help help out help out Val when he when he wants to do when when the real th when it's time for the real thing which is which is to which is to jailbreak the king. Nice. Thing and how that goes, uh, we'll never find out. Never. That was the last update for this game, so. Oh no! Well, we might see yeah. a sequel if they ever yeah. make one. <laughs> like that's the guess at this po point that. Point the uh, points uh, point so. I guess that's yeah, it. So, <laughs> we'll have uh, to leave yeah, the, you guys hanging just like where the game left us hanging. <laughs> yeah. So. Yeah. So. That's it for all the ca character choice and the conquest mode, and that's and for the conquest mode. Mode. So. So. Like, yeah, we might come like, back for Gauntlet in the weekly challenge when there's a weekly challenge, but. We'll have to wait for the right weekly challenge and to do it, so. <laughs> yeah, true. So I think yeah, uh, true, next time true. we'll probably record something different, maybe, depending on what the weekly challenge is. <laughs> yeah. 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 So, next, so, yeah, we'll see you with whatever we decide to do next time. Yeah, I think I figured it out. <laughs> but we'll see. Bye. Bye.